Well, welcome to this video presentation. We're just going to show you here the differences in tube size between a 30mm conceived plus tube on the uh, left and its larger, more commonly sold 75mm tube on the right. Now, depending on how much of this you apply each time, uh, we can give you some guidance in terms of how long the tube's going to last. A uh, 30mm tube is intended to get you through one to two cycles and the bigger 75 mils intended to get you through about three months of cycles. But obviously depending on how they're used and how often and frequently they're used, uh, these could last for extremely uh, longer periods of time than that. Uh, we're often asked once the security seal on the tubes is broken, how quickly has the uh, lubricant got to be used? And the manufacturer's recommendation when they've been pushed on this is that ideally it should be used within three months from the time of first opening the seal. But no studies that we're aware of have been done to see if there are any contamination or other problems that can occur from these tubes being used as a direct, direct application or applied onto a finger in terms of contamination from bacteria. In all likelihood, this is extremely unlikely and rare, so we don't feel there's any real reason why these can't be used until the uh, tube's empty. Now Conceive Plus is uh, formulated basically to uh, give you comfortable lubrication at times when you're trying to conceive, which can obviously be quite stressful times for some couples who have been trying for some time. These lubricants are uh, formulated to not form a barrier to sperm motility and not cause any DNA or other degenerative uh, side effects with the actual sperm themselves. Uh, studies have shown that traditional lubricants and particularly water-based lubricants do form barriers to sperm motility and can reduce chances of conception post-intercourse if used at these times. So these type of fertility specialist lubricants are really ideally formulated and targeted at couples at the time mid-cycle, round ovulation on the run-up to ovulation when conception is most likely and the chances of uh, that occurring can be uh, certainly not affected by the use of these lubricants. We would emphasise that there's no active ingredient in these lubricants that in any way promote or enhance chances of conception occurring. Uh, all you're doing is removing one of the possible barriers that can occur if uh, unsuitable lubricant were to be used. So these are the two common applications for Conceive Plus made by Sasmar. It's manufactured in France available both on the high street but more commonly through internet. Um, the tube on the, the left, the 30mm tube, retails for between 8 and £12 pounds, and its larger big brother, the 75mm, between £14 and £16. Pounds.